Good evening and welcome to the Marine Travel Arena for this most sit Northern Premier League fixture between Marine and Salford City FC. Two changes for Salford, Gareth Stockforth and Jordan Hume co both come straight back into the team with Scott Burton injured and John Johnson dropping to the bench. Gareth Seddon also makes a return with Richie Allen dropping to the bench. It's not got much for a run up high, but he just about gets it in. He's launched off the box, and gets a flick on Chris Lynch through the touch. Goal! Chris Lynch! Fantastic touch! And he just flicks on into the top of the net. It's a great header from Senna to get it across to him from Hines' throw. And he took it on his, I think he took it on his knee and just prodded it in to take it past the defenders. But it is 1 0 to Salford. Chris Lynch, the captain, with the goal on 18 minutes, as you might have just heard. O'Halloran with the throw. Seddon's underneath it, bounces through to Hume but it's back with Marine, get it across to Nicholas on the left-hand side, trying to move into the space he's got ahead of him. Marine playing very central, so Nicholas still got it, gets the cross in. Headed clear by House, I think that wasn't on the volley. I think that might be Mitchley. <laughs> um, hopefully we can use that to our advantage. Hume driving in a goal though, gets it across, hard at the far post! Just misses it slightly in front of him. The forwards on the break there. It's the right decision by Hume to drag it across, but just inches in front of him. I'm with another throw, one throw, flicks on center at the top of the box. Handball, surely. A center smashed that into the ground. I don't know how the referee's seen otherwise. Steps up, curls it nicely. It's a dangerous area. House and clears it off the line. Comes to Weber, heads it across field, back to Hyde. Try and drive it left hand side, just comes off the inside of his leg and Myler wins it back. Wainwright, really poor ball forward. Clark now gets out to the right hand side to, at, to Weber. Driving forward now, Danny Weber, so forgot numbers forward. If he can pick him out, Weber across far post. Allen! And he's headed it wide. Richie Allen at the back post. Probably could have done better with that. He had absolutely acres of space and it was a fantastic cross from Weber. And then Goulding clears it to the right hand side. To Davis turns well past O'Halloran. Davis driving down the right hand side now. Dangerous shots from Reed if they can play it right. O'Halloran is caught up with him. He's just shadowing him as Davis comes into the area. Dummies tries to get the cross in. O'Halloran just blocks him, forces him back up the yards, plays it back out. Myler with the cross. Stop fourth clears underneath it. Comes to Pierce at the edge of the box. Jay Lynch is behind it and it's a good save from Carl Pierce's shots from the edge of the box at his near post. I think he watched it all the way through to get down to his near post, gets his body behind it and just caught it. Cup heads it though, Wainwright pumps it back up the other way. Halson with the head on backwards. It's just going to come back into the penalty area for Jay Lynch to pick up and it slid in by Mitchley. That was very late from the forwards. Stood up, Salford aren't happy and Jay Lynch has stayed down here on the edge of the area. It was very silly from the forwards. Why would you think to do that as a striker? Um, to teach the keeper to stop, to not do with that. Um, you know, it's frustrating when the keepers do that. Wait until the very last second to put the ball up. Um, well, he's, he's dived in his coin, it's a yellow card. No, nothing more, I wouldn't think. Uh, he's just unfortunately caught Lynchy a little bit on the ankle. Um, and he looks like he's in a little bit of pain, uh, so ho hopefully he can he can run that off. But it's just just a bit of a late tackle, nothing too naughty, I don't think. So nothing to worry about. Dawson has it back in Salford's possession, and the ball goes back upfield. Very very end to end stuff here at the Marine Travel Arena. Clark with the ball out to the left hand side does cushion the bounce. So Seddon's on it now, it's being held up by Wayne Wright. Dangerous cross into the box is cleared though. Stop fourth in the middle of the park. Clark trying to get it back through for stop fourth. It's intercepted by Pierce, but Clark has back shoots and what a goal from Luke Clark! It's got to be good 35 yards out, and he has just slammed that along the ground into the far post to give Salford a 2 0 lead after 72 minutes here at the Marine Travel Arena. And there it is, referee David Underwoods blowing the whistle for the final time this match. Marine nil, Salford City 2, Chris Lynch heading his side ahead in the first half.
So Luke Clark adding to that with a long range shot in the second half. Marie not with a shot on target all game. Shows why they're the division's lowest scorers. They really struggled. Their best opportunity, in fact, only real opportunity came when Danny Mitchell volleyed over in the first half. But other than that, a fantastic recovery from Salford. Back to winning ways here in Liverpool.